recent news coverage of China's spy balloon, which was of course shut, shot down by the Biden administration off the coast of South Carolina, has many Americans concerned about the relationship between the United States and China and what that could mean for potential war in the future. And right wing grifters are taking advantage of that, exploiting people's fears to sell them doomsday prepper supplies. Fun. So <laughs> <laughs> at first I thought Which, it was pepper supplies. I'm like, man, they're obsessed with pepper. But, we got salt, they got pepper. But I got I gotta say, man, watching The Last of Us, maybe. Uh. Maybe. Okay. Well, actually, the, the hilarious irony slash tragic irony here <gasps> is that the right wing is going to destroy the world so badly that they're going to get their wish that we have some sort of you know Armageddon kind of event, and we're all you know, and that's is that they dream about it like oh we're all killing each other, and uh, and then I have the most weapons and the most canned fruit, and then I get to kill all the others. Wow, you guys sound really mentally stable. Okay, so keep, but anyway, this is a story about how the right wing monetizes fear, and it's an amazing story. Do they even allow underground bunk bunkers in California because of like fault lines and stuff like that? I don't know. Just something to consider, you know? Anyway, uh, so the F, uh, this effort to sell the doomsday prepper stuff is being spearheaded by just pretty specifically named company, uh, My Patriot Supply, okay? Yeah. It's a preparedness company that sells everything from food supplies to anti-radiation tablets. So here's an example of one thing you can purchase from uh, this company. One year emergency food supply, it'll get you 2,000 calories a day for a full year. And it's just the low, low price of $2,587. Jesus, man. <laughs> God, look, I'm telling you, I, saw, I talked to a marketer who said, it's nearly impossible to sell to the left wing because they have critical thinking still skills. We target the right wing. We also don't have as much money. Yeah, well, that's well, maybe that's true too. But <laughs> uh, he's like, he's like, we target the right wing because it's so easy. They'll believe anything. Twenty five hundred dollars, millions of right wingers. Like, not necessarily with this company, but remember, Alex Jones has been selling this crap for a long time. Not this particular brand necessarily, his own brand, etc. But all, all the right wingers, as you're going to see, sell this kind of stuff. Millions of conservatives have paid unbelievable amounts of money for food that's rotting in their basement. Okay, so look, I, I think one of the better indicators of why right wingers are more likely to buy these supplies is because think about the news they consume. Think about the filter bubble they exist in, which is 24 seven fear, 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 fear. You should be scared, you should be scared, you should be scared. I don't think we do that on this show, right? Like we give you the news, right? But we're not constantly telling you to be fearful about everything and everyone around you. Okay, Like, and, and I'll give one more example, then we'll go to the clips and then I wanna tell you their business model. So in, in, their case, in our case, for example, there are things that are Hugely problematic. For example, we did a story earlier in this show about a train where the brakes had an issue and there was a giant fireball in Ohio. And hey, we're worried that the regulators aren't doing their jobs, the politicians are corrupt, etc. But we don't then come on in the commercial break and be like, now buy train brakes from TYT, okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, exactly. we're just delivering the tragic news as it actually is. Exactly, okay, so with that said, why don't we turn to Charlie Kirk who happened to promote this company's food supplies? There's balloons in our skies, there might be EMPs, I don't know, there's all sorts of weird things happening. But if things start falling apart, you're gonna be well fed, you are nine meals away from anarchy. As you look at the Chinese balloon float above Kansas, Missouri, maybe over your hometown, you can say with confidence that as the Chinese Communist Party takes pictures and spies on you, gets your kids addicted to fentanyl and also hooked on TikTok, at least you will be well fed when anarchy comes. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com, you'll save $200. The food that you have from My Patriot Supply will increase in value. I use My Patriot Supply, and you should as well. And please, if you see the balloon, take a selfie and also say to yourself and your family, when things fall apart, at least I won't go hungry. <laughs> You're nine meals away from anarchy. Uh, no, every part of it is hilarious. And what's... But the, again, the tragic part is that uh, right wingers believe it. It was the same uh, company, uh, their spokesperson was on for an interview with Steve Bannon, mm. went on for 10 minutes. Uh, the EMTs are gonna explode, You're, uh, everybody's about to die. We got a little snippet from Yeah, that. let's watch it and then I wanna tell you what, what they're doing. 
You're, you're the best guys about preparedness. Walk us through what's going on and, and what do you guys recommend right now? Everybody was was kind of freaked out with what happened with this balloon. You know, we think back to an article that was published back in 2018 when the Chinese tested the same technology, but they put three hypersonic missiles on a balloon to test the effectiveness the effectiveness of this. And think about if they were to put an EMP on that, it only takes three EMPs to take down the entire U.S. electrical grid system. So literally, we were seconds away from being pushed back to the dark ages. And it's had our, our customers ringing us like crazy, wanting to get prepared for those types of events. So Faraday bags is a very, very uh, popular item that people are looking at. Anti-radiation tablets, these dosimeter cards, which detect the amount of levels of radiation that you're exposed to. You gotta get your, you, you, gotta, you gotta get ahead of the curve here. You want, you want the State of the Union? Joe Reek just gave you the State of the Union. That's the State of the Union. That rational people now are saying, hey, you know what? Maybe I got to go to My Patriot Supply. I, I, I go for the food, but now I got to look for these other things because of EMP, EMP attacks, potential nuclear weapons. What is it with people having difficulty saying nuclear? Yeah, I know. <laughs> what is it about that word? Anyway, um, listen, if we engage in a nuclear war with China, if you somehow survive because you have your underground bunker with all those supplies and stuff, I guarantee you that eventually you're gonna wanna die. <laughs> like, why would you wanna survive that? Anyway, anyway, let's move on. Yeah, all right, look guys, I mean, he said, you saw it in the tape there, we're literally seconds away from being pushed back to the dark ages. Are we, are we? And this is all over a balloon. They've got him so panicked, they're like, Balloon, they're like, ah, I know it. Anti radiation tablets crack open the, uh, the, you know, the tuna or whatever they got. <laughs> okay, so um, they, the right wing media's business model is this: they create fear, then they monetize fear. So be scared of everything. Be scared of the Chinese Communist Party. The Chinese are now the most capitalist people on earth. Are you? What communism are you talking about? Right. So. But it doesn't matter. The reason they use the word communist is because it's supposed to scare you. Oh, watch out for the immigrants, they're coming across the border. It's an invasion. Oh, the Muslims, oh my, oh my God, the transgender people, oh, they're invading your bathroom. Okay, actually, balloons. So, my Patriot Supply loves to engage in the fear mongering themselves, of course, because that's how they sell their product, that's how they move their product. So, I'm gonna give you a few examples of things that they have um, put up on their website. CBDC tyranny, uh, tyranny is coming, how to prepare, okay? Seven years until the great reset of 2030. Here's another one, how to prepare for and survive a nuclear disaster. Yeah, and let me guess, with your anti-radiation tablets. Right, which is probably iodine. <laughs> which is probably nothing. Anyway, uh, so um, look guys, uh, what does that do? It creates an incentive for right wing media to scare the living hell out of their audience, mm -hmm. right or wrong, get them panicked about everything. They're not doing news. The Russian boy used to say this all the time. And to be fair, he was honest about it at least, right? And he was a terrible guy, but he would say, look, my job is to move product. I'm the thing that's between the ads. The ads is what pays our bills. Okay, in their case now, like what does Alex Jones sell? His number one product is penis pills, because his that's what his audience is worried about. His number two product is brain pills. The second thing his audience is worried about, right? And for Alex Jones and Steve Bannon and Charlie Kirk, for most of these right wing hosts, overall though, for the industry, number one is preparedness and gold. Gold's another giant one. Oh, bad times are coming. Oh, everything's gonna crash, but gold is safe. Overpay for this gold. You could buy gold anywhere. You could buy it at market prices. No, overpay because this gold will keep you safe. Is that what the scam is? I've always wondered about that. Of course, what do they? You could just buy it in the market. Why do you need this scam o right winger selling you gold, right? I don't know. And so I, they realized at some point these marketers for these supply companies, the gold companies, etc. Oh, target the right wing. They're they're the most they're the people who are the most scared in the country because they, the media scares them. Their media scares their them. media scares them. Plus, it's in their nature. That's why they're always looking for an alpha male to lead them because they're betas. And since they're just naturally scared, they're like, oh, I need a leader. I need an authoritarian leader. 
I don't want to make any decisions, I'm so scared. Well, a marketer in capitalism is naturally gonna see that and go, "Oh my God, these guys are gonna be so easy to sell to. One, they're suckers, and two, they're scared of everything. So we just scare them a little bit more, balloons. Soon it's gonna be like 99 Zoof balloons or whatever that song goes, right? And so the 99 red balloons from the 1980s, it's a German song. And then people are gonna like, oh, 99 red communist balloons, we're all gonna die, preparedness. <laughs> okay, so you watch, if you watch any right wing show, they all sell that junk. And that's why they're trying to scare the hell out of you. Thanks for watching The Young Turks, I really appreciate it. Another way to show support is through YouTube memberships. You'll get to interact with us more. There's live chat emojis, badges. You've got emojis of me, Anna, John, JR. So those are super fun. But you also get playback of our exclusive member only shows and specials right after they air. So all of that, all you gotta do is click that join button right underneath the video. Thank you.